Hello, Internet. It is Secret Plot 45. We're just doing a normal commentary today about a topic that uh, I've been wanting to talk about for a little bit. Um, the thing that kind of inspired me to talk about this was a tweet on uh, Synergy Furky's account, uh, at Synfurky. And uh, he says, This personality thing has gotten so out of hand, so bad, people are literally questioning why Flush is in phase and why he doesn't do those videos. People are starting to think that rage videos and embarrassing yourself IRL is better than hitting clips. So, um, I'm, I'm kind of torn on this topic because, um, the purpose of clan channels and just, uh, Call of Duty, like, in YouTube in general is to entertain people. So it makes sense to bring, like, personalities in and get it to, um, where you're familiar with the people you're watching Trickshot. Like, that's a good thing. I, I do approve of that. But it, there's a certain point where, like, different people are good at different things. And, like, this all kind of started with FaZe Jev. Like, um, I, first of all, I love Jev to death. And all the people I talk about in this video, I, I like all of them. I'm not trying to hate on all of them, no matter what I say. So, um, I'm just gonna throw that out there. But it started with FaZe Jev. And, um, Jev was in TK for a while. He started making, uh, kind of rage videos where he gets, uh, he plays a variety of Call of Duties and other games. Uh, I think it was mainly Modern Warfare 3. And, uh, he just, he gets mad a lot. And uh, a lot of people didn't really think he was that good because his videos are, I'm sure you've seen them, like cut commentaries. And essentially, he doesn't show normally himself hitting like amazing bangers or getting high scores that like someone like FaZe Outcast does. A lot of times he just shows himself getting killed by a variety of different ways and getting really mad. And it can be really funny. He's a very, very comedic guy. But um, it does not give off the impression that he's actually good at Call of Duty. So when he was recruited to FaZe, I was really confused because I had never really seen any of his clips or anything aside for like some quad feeds that he'd hit in his videos. And uh, he he put those fears to rest. He released an episode and it it's really good. Um, and he's definitely a talented Call of Duty player. But after that, uh, especially with the Phase 5, you can see there's starting to be a shift that um, uploading on your personal channel is almost as important as your clips nowadays. And that's, it's kind of bugging me. Um, like, in the top 20, I'm sure a lot of you guys have all <laughs> heard of or seen um, BLS. And um, BLS is a guy that I'm going to say it outright, first of all. Um, I know I said in the beginning that I don't really dislike anyone that I talked about in this video. That's a lie. I really don't like BLS. Um, his clips... Um, to be honest, really aren't that good, um, and he's just wicked annoying, in my opinion. I, I cannot watch his videos. He's just too obnoxious. But anyway, um, he got in the phase top 20 from solely, like, his personality and his channel. Um, I'm gonna be honest. He had, like, I, I watched his response, and unless, like, it was better than I thought it was at the time, it was really not that good. Like, all the shots were kind of standard and not unique. He had some, like, one or two good shots, like, uh, that were, like, across the map on Turbine. But for the most part, he got in because of his personal channel. And, you know, I'm good for BLS. He's got a good personal channel. It's obviously, I mean, like, he's got more subscribers than me, so he's doing something right. But, um... It, it really kind of worries me that as a as a community we're kind of going toward that and um, it's made me honestly it's made me really kind of stop watching FaZe and I do I do still watch FaZe I watch their episodes I watch the content they put out but I really don't enjoy them as much as I used to I would much much rather watch an episode on Soar or Obey or I don't know like L7 just whatever clan that's not phase because generally the clips are more unique they're better all the phase members like when you see them do their live comms uh rain and adapt especially I'm sorry but they overreact to like such like simple shots like you know they some of them are distant but like they're really not that great you know they're not only that are they not that great but their shots like everyone has gone for like 20 million times like phase adapt especially like he was just like shoot a sniper and insta swap like that's all he does and it's really i think kind of bogging phase down whereas if you look at like uh the recent uh what is Soar's kill cam series? I think it's Soaring with Style. Yeah, Soaring with Style. It's just ridiculous. And the stuff that their members can do is just ridiculous. They're so crazy. All the shots are unique. They're distant. They're clean. They're just awesome. Whereas, like, the ill cams, like, it's, it's not... 
I mean, it's not bad, and FaZe has some good members, but it's just, it's not as groundbreaking as it was when I started playing Call of Duty. But, like I said, I do think a healthy mix of uh, personality and clips is good. I do think you should be doing, like, face cams. Like I said, I'm trying to do face cams. I do think you should be showing yourself, but, like, personality is for your personal channel. It's not necessary to broadcast to the entire world. Although, I do think, you know, in certain exceptions, it, it should be done, like, uh, but I think FaZe is taking it a little bit too far, and people like Soar and maybe even Obey, I've got, like, a better idea. But I want to know what you guys think. Um, do you guys care about the personality aspect at all? Uh, what about clips? Um, which do you think is more important? Which, would you rather see a, an episode from a guy you really like or a really sick episode from a guy you really don't know that much about? Let me know in the comments. I'm curious to hear your thoughts. And, uh, it's been Secret, guys. Peace.